Welcome to another episode of the Art of Living show. I'm your host, Naila. Today, we are interviewing and profiling the same person you saw some time back. She's moved into a new space and we want to find out what exactly has changed, what has evolved in her life. We're going to learn what to do when you're moving into a new premises with the same resources and make it work for you. All you need to do is just learn the hacks and we're gonna learn that from Erica. I'm so excited and I can't wait to see and learn one or two things that has changed about her life. Darling, darling, Yay. you look fabulous. Do I? You look so fabulous. Did I get the heart right? That's you what I was worried about. So perfect. You know what I mean? <laughs> this is what this word I say. When you're my friend, you yes. have to look good. But I think my heart is falling. Do you want to fix I will, it? I will fix it. Anyway, let's let's talk about the car. That's my dream car. Oh, is it? Yeah. Is it I mean, 200? one of them, yeah. It's, it's, it's a Mercedes. It's a Mercedes. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's a Mercedes. That's I know. It. Can I fix you in? Okay. Can cool. I fix it? But you got okay. everything. You look Thank fabulous. You. So I'm Thank happy. you. Thank I'm you. I'm happy. about your new space how did you discover this place i love it it found me i think it's the god what happened? i mean you know life life happened and uh -huh. god provided for me this space mm. these are for you by the way thank you they look they look good you know i'm like that fruit person and you know i like my bubbles i know and i want you to talk to me about this space i love the fact that it's so different it's so exotic. I, as I said, it found me. The whole thing found me. Uh -huh. I was looking for something with light and something that I can work with. Okay. Like, you know, I work from home and that's how I live and I motivate myself. Okay. And I always have to see what I'm creating. Okay. So when I wake up, I need to see what more is lacking or mm -hmm. what more I need to create. So you needed a beautiful house that had a lot of lighting. Yes. How big is and, the house? And the, and the ceiling. How big is this house? I do not know how big it is. Honestly. But how many rooms is it? I think there are like six bedrooms. Six bedrooms? Yes. Wow, yes. that's amazing. Oh, but, you I know, I live from here and work from here, so it's very different. It's very yeah. different. Yes. And you got new pieces. I got new pieces. And now you're, I think, now focusing on luxury because everything I'm looking at is very exotic and different. And you can Talk see. to me about that. So where do you source your stuff from? I source it to any country I'm, I'm traveling for work. You know, mm. it's like I don't dedicate myself to source from a specific space okay. So I will, or place. So what I do is like, if I'm called for a job in Singapore, that's where I will be. Okay. If I'm traveling probably to Tanzania, that's where I will source it from. Okay. If I'm traveling to Korea, that's how I will. I mean, I, I, when I'm, I'm sourcing, as a curator, where my, my body takes me. So let's walk around. I, I think you know most of this stuff. It's just like new shoes, you know, like but you this know, shoe. Do. This shoe, I know that's the one you're mad about. <laughs> Talk to me about this shoe. So, how much is this shoe? How many dollars is it? That's uh, I know you can only put it in dollars. 350? It's not that much, you know? Oh, that's yeah. like 5,000 Kenya shillings. And the moon bag, mm -hmm. yeah, that's $200. $200, yes. I love it. Looks good on me. It looks good on you. Can I smile harder? Maybe I can get. You know? Yeah, you know, we need to all work hard and pay ourselves. So right, at the end of the come, day, you know. Awesome. Now it's time for the the kitchen. All right. Have you seen the? You know how I like to cook. So yes, spices there. All your spices. Yeah. You're so homely. Your husband is very lucky. I think, I think I'm also lucky. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Yeah, we're both lucky. It looks like you, you've increased the number of your spices. spices. Yeah, yes. I mean, I, I was in Zanzibar recently. Oh, wow. And you? I decided to do more spices. Okay, yes. nice. Yeah. As you can see, the new improvement, that what you're holding is a, it's either, I, I'm now working with Trukana women, mm -hmm. where I'm making um, wine bags and champagne okay. bags. Okay. And yeah, those are the gifts I think somebody should get, you know, 
for Christmas and so, so this is a champagne bag that's a champagne yeah you know it's it's African made and it's supporting women in Turkana okay and that's what I'm working with and I'm okay. like you know I'm blessed in one hand and you kind of you also share. give back you give back oh wow. but I only give back I, I always believe you give back to where you believe yes. and where creativity is I, I like agree. creating things yes that's, what it is. that's so you fantastic see, I all my teas yeah. I take different teas for for different I wouldn't say reasons, but your body needs different kind of teas. Okay. It's like detoxifying, but you need to know what you're detoxifying. Okay. And you, you can see I have a Roselle tea. Mm -hmm. So this is good for cleansing the liver. Mm -hmm. And then I do more of lavender. Mm -hmm. I dry them myself. Dried uh, dates are also very good for your digestive. Fantastic. Yeah, you know, everything. And this is one of some Chinese tea that it looks you strange, use. But yeah, yeah, you know, mm -hmm. to clean everything. I don't know okay. what to clean with. in terms of um, the, the, the pieces that you had the last time other than what you've sold before? I've kept my signature pieces because I need my signature pieces to stand and it's part of my story. Mm -hmm. Then of course I add details here and there because okay. they're sourced from different parts of the world. Okay. And um, you know, that's, uh, that's it. So oh, this is nice. like my private uh, Launch? I, I, yeah, launch. Or I kind of read here most of the time, as you, right. can, you can observe. All right. So this is my reading space and where my friends come and yeah. And lounge. And you can, yeah. You can and see. the fabulous hearts are still there. I have so enough nice. of them, you know, they're yes. different colors. Yes. Yeah. I thought I saw you in a magazine. Oh yeah, let me show you the magazine. Yeah. But do you want to, to check out the, the balcony and the bedroom, then I'll show you the magazine. Okay, cool. Yeah, Let's cool. Let's do that. Let's do it. Oh, you got new art. Did you have this the last time on It is, and this is from, uh, I told you, I think I told you, this is from, which is a country, it's, a, it's a French Polynesia. Okay. This is from French Polynesia, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. yeah. That is nice. So let's look at the new space yeah, where you come my, and chill. Yeah, my private place. <gasps> the jewelry. Oh my God. Yeah, I love jewelry. Ah, yeah, yeah. My goodness. This is amazing. This is so beautiful. Yeah. Erica. Can I be your sister? You can. Really? I'll adopt you. You'll adopt me? <laughs> yeah. We can sign the papers today. We can sign the papers today. Yeah. Wow, look at this. It's beautiful. So these are for you? Yeah, these are for me. You know, I, I have to love myself and then, you know, when you, when you, and I always buy pieces sometimes okay. for myself. Okay. Then I try out and okay. also know the designer, if the quality is good okay. or how long it lasts. So I do it on myself first okay. and then some pieces, then I'm selling them. Then you sell them? No, I don't sell you these don't ones. Sell. I these buy, are for, I, I are for me. Okay. So I have some of my, you know, the, the scarabs, yes. as you featured last time. Yeah. So the same story and you're wearing a scarab, you know, that's that's like my good luck. Okay. And did you know that one of the people who really made me do the scarabs was Steven Taylor wow. of Aerosmith. I, I literally see. crushed her party and he loved it. Are you serious? Nah, that's oh a story. God. But where do you get your inspiration from? That mind, that creativity, that passion for luxury, where I do you get it from? Oh, the passion for luxury has always been there. You have an eye, you know, from when I was young. Okay. I, I, I don't know if I told you, like, I used to be, I used to study in a boarding school mm -hmm. and I will save my, my breakfast money, you know, that bread money yes. or any anything you have. Yes. So I'll save it so at the end of the semester yes i'll find myself going to kikomba yes okay. and then when i was in college i used to dress very crazy and okay i mean some would consider crazy but i think it was very arty so you started when we were very young yeah amazing. and every money i saved it amazing just to dress so it's inborn you were born a creative yes and you have passion for luxury just beautiful and finer things in life i think luxury people confuse what it is it's it's it's, it's in the details you know okay. it's in the craftsmanship as you see the the turkana pieces yes they they have done a good job okay that is luxury it takes three days on each basket okay. that's part of luxury okay. so if they do a very good job yes i'm happy yes but it depends how you sell luxury okay uh, luxury is fine things mm -hmm. and your time and my time. time and my time i agreed yes. i totally agree you cannot get that one.